Hey, what's up YouTube? It's MJVI96 with Windows Help Live. And I'm here with the first of many videos that is going to be part of a tutorial series on Photoscape. It is a um, kind of a generic, little generic editing program, but, um, photo editing program. It's kind of a generic version of uh, <clears throat> Photoshop, but it's a cool little thing, and I'm going to do a uh, series of, um, tutorials about it because it's um it's fun to use if you know what you're looking for and I spent a lot of time playing around with it and I found a lot of cool little effects to it. So this first tutorial is just gonna be basic editing here guys. This is the picture we're gonna start out with. This is just right here in Windows Live Photo Gallery. I'm just showing you guys the picture. It's just a real basic Christmas morning picture of me and my sister holding up two of our presents. And um it's a cool little thing. And uh yeah so we are just gonna get going with this. So, um, here's Photoscape, and like I said, here's the picture. Now, that what we're going to do is we're just going to start with a basic crop, guys. Well, um, my two main things I'm going to try to get out of here right now are I'm going to try to get rid of the Christmas tree and get rid of this date here. So, what we're going to do is bring down from the top here, and we want to cut out that picture there, or cut out that um, set of letters there, and bring it together like this. And now you can see that the brighter area is what you're going to keep. We're just going to go down here, click crop. There we go. We've already got a much better picture. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go in here to region, red eye. And we're going to zoom in a little bit so we can see what we're doing. Zoom in one more. Alright, let's go to screen scroll. Alright, now we're going to attempt to take this red eye out here. Now, um, red eye is caused by the flash of a camera. And, um... It, but it's easily removed in this editing program. So what you're going to do is just like you drag and highlight something on your desktop, you're just going to drag and highlight this little square right over the eye like that. And there you go. Now it does look kind of screwed up from up here, but it's actually really not that screwed up. It does take the eye color out, just kind of blacks it out. But it does look 100% better than the red eye itself. So it's still a much better idea in my opinion. Alright, so now we've got that. We can zoom back out. Guys, and we've got this so far here. Now we're just going to go home here. And we're just going to add a little frame here. It's happened on Christmas. Go ahead and do a little Christmas frame like that. Photo frame. And we're going to click frame line, I think. And make it a little thicker. That's not what we wanted. And this is where you can edit, you know, you can edit all your frame thickness and whatnot. But anyway, that's alright there. It's just a little Christmassy looking thing. And, um, yeah change the bloom of it I usually go in and change the bloom it does kind of you know give it you can brighten up a little bit clear it up it's kind of blurry this picture wasn't all that bad though and we want to make it look deeper now this does look kind of dark right now but we are going to brighten it up here in just a minute <clears throat> And now that you got this, you can just kind of play around with those. I mean, it dep all depends on how you want it. Now we got it like this. I usually backlight it a little bit. Not that much. Makes it look a little better. You know, really brings out the color. If we zoom in a little bit, you can see. It really brings out the color. And the, you, can, you can see the packaging. The colors on the shirts. And whatnot, and makes everything look kind of realistic. Looks, adds a little more texture to everything, and looks pretty good. So in just that short little amount of time here, we have gone from. If I can find it, we've gone from this right here, the original picture with the red eye, Christmas tree in the way to the date, to this cool little thing right here. It's not perfect, I'm not really, my thing's more video, but, 
you know, photos pretty cool and I'm getting into graphic design and anything like that, but it does make the picture look a lot better and I know from what I do know about photo design and photography, it will make sure the colors really stand out and it does. So yeah guys, this is just the first tutorial of many to come. There'll be more posted here in just a few. But yeah guys, this was just basic editing in Photoscape guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed and subscribe for more awesome tutorials. Thanks guys.